Welcome to this tutorial video of the Modular X Machine Vision software. In this video, I'm going to show you how to detect the presence of a surface mounted device. The functions you need to complete this task is some image enhancement functions and the geometric function. So let's simulate our acquire image step by using the simulate step in Modular X. Let's select the pass part. Select cycle through forward on the image directory and click on the accept button. And now we have to convert this image to a binary one. So let's use the threshold image function. We are looking for bright objects on the image. So let's select here the bright objects. By the way, it's the default value. So the important thing for us is to get the shape of the object. So that's set this value until we don't get the correct shape of the object. Let's set this value to 30. And now we are going to fill these holes within the image. And let's use the advanced morphology and fill holes function. And as you can see, fill holes in the particle with pixel number one. Let's click on the accept button. And now reduce some noise on the image by using the basic morphology functions and the erode objects click on the accept button now we finished with the image enhancement step in this application so now let's use the geometric match function you can find the step in the locate features in geometric matching this is a template based step so you teach in a template with the function and then it is going to look for in the image and compares the given template by the user and when it finds it is going to indicate and returns with a score value with the match so let's just use it click on the new template button select a part and define the template region and click on the define curves tab as you can see it found the curves correctly the shape of the object so all you need to do is just go through all the tabs over here and save your template now you can close this window and let's set up the parameters over here so first of all we are looking for certain objects so let's set this to 13 and also let's define the region of interest select this rectangle roi and draw roi on the image and let's just take a look on the score values of the first object is about 900 the second one is also it's all above 900 so let's set the score value the minimum match score value to 900 and before we continue cl we click on the accept button let's set the pass inspection if minimum number of matches is 13 and the maximum number of matches is also 13 and now we finished click on the accept button and let's check it out how it works yeah I just didn't find the last one over here so let's go back to the function and I guess we should decrease the score minimum mass score value to for example let's just 890 no it's not enough let's check out the value of the last object the score value of that object is let's buy let's sort by x position and now it's sure we're going to take a look at that so it's 848 so let's 
such as 840. And now let's go back to the simulate tab and select all the images we have. Let's go through all of them to figure it out how it works. So, as you can see here, we got a part that that's missing actually. And there is another one in the next image that is missing. This is a good part. This is also a good part. And here, if you click on the simulate step, you can see the original image. So here, as you can see, too much solder and also a part is missing over here. So that's all. It's so easy, as you can see. I hope this video was helpful. And before we finish, let's set the session status. Let's just use the session status tab and select equals to specify measurement and the geometric matching step status and click on the accept button. And now this time when you're going through the images, the session status indicator is going to be set according to the geometric match uh, function. So this is a fail part, fail pass found all the surface mounted devices on the image so thanks for watching i hope this video this tutorial was helpful and keep updated because we're going to post more videos related to using the modular x have a nice day bye